Hey guys, Amp here bringing you another Affinity Photo tutorial, and in this tutorial we will be going over uh, the levels adjustment. And to do this, there are two different ways you can go about uh, adding levels and such, but you can see the various levels over here. And uh, the first one is a simple auto levels adjustment. You can come up to filters, colors, and auto levels. And uh, it just kind of evens and stretches out all of these uh, regular levels. So you can uh, see what happens here if I hit Command Z. And uh, it kind of adds uh, to the effect. It uh, makes everything more even out. And uh, it makes it more of a natural look. Uh, if you feel like you wanted to edit... Uh, more in depth and you wanted to uh, add to something your own you can come over and uh, choose the uh, levels adjustments under layer adjustment layer level adjustment and it brings up the levels panel now this allows you to adjust the blacks the whites and the gamma. So if you if I if you just you can uh, slay move you can even change the blend mode on how you want it. But I just th I think I'm gonna I think I'll just leave it on normal. So if you bring up gamma, you can go to bring out the sort of tone you want. Uh, right now it is on RGB, but you can even uh, switch to gray, CMYK. You can have various uh, changes in whatever you want. So you can choose, if you're in RGB, you can choose master, red, green, blue, and alpha. So this allows you to uh, adjust for total reds, total blues. And bring more blue in the back. And uh, total green. So that has been the levels panel in Affinity Photo. Uh, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more Affinity Photo tutorials.